सो हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द टॉप ऑफ स्टॉक जैसा कि आपने सुना होगा कि जहां चाह होती है वहां पर राह होती है अगर आप मजबूती से शिद्दत से अपनी मेहनत के लिए खड़े होते हैं तो आपको एक दिन मंजिल जरूर मिलती है तो आज हमारे साथ ही एक ऐसे स्टूडेंट हैं जिन्होंने आर 2024 के एग्जाम को आर भुवनेश्वर के जोन से क्लियर किया है मैकेनिकल ब्रांच के स्टूडेंट हैं सुपर कोचिंग के स्टूडेंट हैं तो आइए आज मैं आपको उनसे मिलवाता हूँ एक और टॉपर के लिस्ट में एक और नाम एड हुआ है और ये है मिस्टर सतीश जिन्होंने आर भुवनेश्वर को क्लियर किया है और अपने जेई बनने का सपना एक पूरा किया है और तो मैं इनसे थोड़ी सी इनकी जर्नी शेयर करूंगा आप लोगों के साथ तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट मी इंट्रोड्यूस the one and only satish who have cleared rrb jee from bhuvaneshwar zone so satish let me congratulate you first and your family for getting this success thank you sir thank you so much so satish how are you feeling i mean how your family is feeling and how you are feeling uh, actually i am feeling really very happy sir because this job is very uh, mandatory for me and my family and uh, i really oh. thankful to textbook also because of textbook i uh, today i got this uh, Uh, opportunity uh, to crack the RRB JE exam because uh, I'm not so good at my graduation level. Uh, I started from scratch uh, uh, while preparing for JE, and I, three, in three months uh, have uh, seen very good results uh, by following the test books timetable and following the test book series test series. So I'm really grateful for test book what it has been giving for me. and and as, and also my parents my parents are very happy sir because they dream uh, for me that i have to become some government officer uh, and it has been fulfilled, fulfilled through the test books sir so i am really really happy sir satish when you uh, started fight continuously and one day when you become success so this is the biggest gift ever which you can present to your uh, your parents you know mom and dad so satish can you please share your journey in a uh, short manner like uh, your uh, you have done graduation or diploma and uh, first attempt or rrb je or second attempt so please can you share your journey yes sir uh, sure sir actually uh, i started my rrb journey uh, when i completed graduation and within two months uh, i got uh, notification of rrb je has been came uh, and actually i'm not so good at academics uh, while i'm studying graduation Uh, my father uh, came to me and said that uh, the railway uh, gave some new notification you have to apply it and, and i really don't know what is je also sir but i started preparing and cbt1 was cleared uh, normally sir it was not so not so big deal for me because it's aptitude and maths i'm good at it sir but uh, core subject i'm not so uh, perfect and my big brother came to me and, and said about test book test series sir actually firstly he said uh, test series were very good Uh, they damn good because uh, their level is very high so when you wrote the exams directly it will become very easy for you when you go- got good score in these uh, uh, test book test series so i d- literally practiced every day uh, before cbt1 one, one month i ca- uh, completely dedicated to, to test series so and i got good results sir actually it was a medium result i got uh, nearly 66 marks like that and i have been qualified uh, but it, uh, the suffer comes for uh, cbt2 sir i really didn't know how to prepare i really uh, don't know the core subject very well so i took super coaching and uh, i think it's really very very low cost sir compared to outside uh, uh, coaching centers and uh, uh, and real i'm real thankful my father that he uh, he said you can go through this and it will be helpful for you so i started in test book uh uh startingly uh, means i don't have any time table sir to prepare okay. but what's big beautiful thing about test book is it has a complete time table how to prepare so i i blindly follow test book uh, time table uh, and i i have been seen results within two months sir. so that uh, and three months i go, i getting scores above means in test book i am getting scores nearly 90 Uh, but uh, when i came to exam uh, i got to more than what i wrote in test book test series so then i understood that these levels uh, these test book test series level was very good so i can score well uh, even in outside exams when i have to write these test series so this is my journey i got through the uh, this rrb i cra- cracking this rrb je sir so satish i have completed your btech na yes sir okay so from which state you belong to I belong to uh, Andhra Pradesh, sir. Andhra Pradesh. So, Satish, as I have said, that I am not technically sound. I am not very much. I am. I am not pretty much good at technical subject. 
and uh, you have also told me that this was your first attempt and you have cleared rrb in your first attempt yes sir and despite the fact that you were saying that you are not so good at technical subject yes, so cracking rrb j is difficult or it, it is easy if continuity has to be maintained so cracking rrb j is typical or it is easier uh, actually uh, it it depends on individual sir actually for me uh, uh, it became easy because uh, i i wrote the uh, test series which are very standard which are uh, nearly ssc j standards sir so it which uh, which became for me very easy sir Uh, but preparing is a biggest challenge. Preparing for RRBJ is biggest challenge. Means we have to mentally tough, sir. We have to mentally tough, and we have to follow blindly uh, whatever it means. We, we have to be uh, not to see what time it is. Uh, means uh, in in a day, I nearly studied fifteen uh, hours for for one month because I know it is very difficult if I in these three months to crack something like RRBJ. so i prepared very hard and i i'm i'm blindly followed the uh, time table of the rrbj actually in starting there are some subjects uh, which i have been not completed but uh, i have to spare some time for that and i completed uh, and uh, i completed in like uh, i kept my 100% sir so uh, it became for me it became very easy when it comes to then and i'm damn sure uh, i will pursue more not only this rrbj because the confidence has came from me came for me through test books so i am very uh, really grateful to test books okay you mean to say satish if you are consistent if you are continue if you are regular you can crack any j level exam within 3 to 4 months yes sir uh, definitely definitely okay so satish uh, um, uh, can you share your score in rrb j how 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 much score you have got yeah, uh, i got my ras score of 95 marks and uh, when it comes to pro rated score i got 100 out of 150 sir uh, 100 out of 150 and the category is my category is sc sir acha sc category okay so uh, so many students are watching you like your brothers and sisters are watching you so any suggestion you want to add here for them so that because you know ki rrbj 2025 notification is about to come within few days so okay. any special point you want to mention here so that that can be helpful for your like brothers and sisters <clears throat> yes, sir uh, sure sir uh, i will mention one thing that uh, what means don't uh, judge on your standards sir means if you feel that uh, i am not so capable for that just uh, take example of me uh, because i am not so capable when i completed my graduation but my father believed in me that you can make it so i am i am a very 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 ordinary student sir Uh, while i completed my graduation but uh, when i mentally fixed it and i i mentally fixed it to do something or achieve something uh, which are greater so i we have to be mentally tough and we have some motivation so definitely we can pursue our dreams uh, it will be very easy when you have a certain kind of motivation uh, there they can be, motivation could be anything sir like family problems or any other things like uh, some any any other things so it, it should be give you the way to pursue your success so if you feel that my final suggestion is if you feel that you can't do like anything which are greater just take example of me because i'm very ordinary person but with the help of test book and with the support of my parents i cracked this and i will go further not only this sir yes sir this is my uh, okay satish so with, with your continuous efforts with your consistency and with the blessing of your parents uh, finally you have cracked rrbj so uh, i want to ask one thing uh, what should be the study pattern for your uh, like so many students are watching you actually they want to know that how sh- how i should prepare so that i can crack exam within 3 months or 4 months so what should be a proper strategy can you share your strategy a little bit sure sir actually uh, for for a particular strategy means you have to take time out of your day sir means uh, you have to mentally uh, means you we have don't think that uh, challenge is big, bigger challenges means uh, we, in one year i have to uh, do this thing no sir means we have to make challenges for one day means in one day i have to complete these 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 kind of subjects or for example i have to complete you mean to one. say you mean to say everyone everyone has to set short goals short goals sir yes sir i i'm i mean i meant that so okay. you have to Pursue through short goals, sir. 
one day i have to complete this thing when these short goals will uh, give you means on time it will give you more success sir uh, they will give you a cumulative effort yes uh, sir yes sir okay. so okay, sir. okay. Uh, so satish uh, short goals this is the first strategy and uh, which subject uh, on which subject you have focused more for rrbj particularly actually i i belongs to mechanical sir and in mechanical production has a major part okay so uh, it nearly 50 marks uh, production comes sir. so i in starting i prepared for production only sir very i nearly uh, daily i did 200 questions from production in textbook every ssc question whatever i question i seen i just uh, blindly i just follow how it came even it was not my standard i have prepared for that sir Very so good. yeah i have to say sir uh, starting i neglected thermodynamics uh, which was your subject sir but uh, in after some time i got some time means i actually i have fear for thermodynamics through from my graduation level but uh, when i listen your classes It, it became very easy for me sir actually i never talked to you so I means i never come to live classes sir uh, i came for recorded ones okay. so it really helped me it means it became very easy and i completed all the heat transfer every portion of that in my final days and it added the uh, what to say it added me more marks for for the rrbj exam sir sadish you know like you have said ki thermodynamics appears to be very tough for you so when i was student i also feel felt like that thermodynamics was one of the toughest subject for me also in my uh, like students time so but uh, if you have zeal if you have enthusiasm for a particular subject if you want to do it you can do it yes, definitely sir. so satish can you share uh, something of, like your family background can you tell me uh, about your father your brother sure sir actually uh my mother was in uh, uh, health sec- health secretary uh, in vijayak sir in vijayak district okay. and my father was a contractor who was before an engineer telecom engineer now he is doing some contract works and and also my brother was studying agriculture engineering which is uh, different from uh, all the other engineering streams he was doing uh, agriculture engineering and uh, this is my family and I, we are four members but uh, m- it means to financially we're not so stable sir from beginning of my days but so, now you will be yes sir now you will be <laughs> every financial crisis will be solved now yes, because sir. you have done it my dear friend yes, sir. and uh, you know uh, there is one famous saying yes sir when you get your job you can support your family and your upcoming generations will also learn something from you that yes. if my brother has done it definitely i can Yes, sir. Yes, okay, sir. so uh, Satish, one last question: How to prepare for non-technical section? Because majority of the students who are from technical background, especially from mechanical engineering, because you know, like SSCJ uh, has released its final vacancy today for yes, 2025, and there is very less vacancy for mechanical, especially only for mechanical, not combined electrical mechanical. Yes, so uh, there is a crisis of vacancy. So in this scenario, if you if you are from technical background. so how to focus focus moon, mainly on non technical section how to prepare non technical section mainly uh, sir actually uh, we know that non technical was very uh, less marks compared to technical but uh, mm-hmm. for non technical um, means if we are preparing for technical it means which means uh, there is some subject related to technical in non technical also for me there is computer and uh, environmental science which was beginningly it was not so easy for me but after all i have uh, taken some spare time for that uh, daily one one to two hours i taken spare for that means for one month it became very much time so and i also studied uh, subjects from certain books and it is uh, uh, so like that it happened means we have can spare some time for the non technical part and it will be okay if we good at technical we have to uh, concentrate on non technical also sir Yes, okay so uh, last two to two to three points you have to tell to your friends so that they can clear 2025 examination whether it be ssc j or rrb j so if you want to add it, if you want to give them two suggestions yes, what would that be uh, so uh, i if I, if i have to give suggestions i will say that whatever you do do your 100% not for marks or not for any other thing do it with 100% heart and 100% mind sir means you have to be in that subject whenever you studying that subject 
don't think about future how it will be happen means it is the it is a part of one year journey when you are preparing for a government exam so don't think about the future you have to think about now what you have what you can do today so if you do that it will lead you to uh, whatever you want to get succeed that, that is my only suggestion i will give to my future my brother sir because because uh, the work is a path function the longer you travel the maximum efficiency you will get yes, so satish uh, was nice talking to you and uh, are you satisfied with the lectures and test series finally i am absolutely satisfied sir and uh, uh, i really means we actually test book was means in our states actually it was not so that means anyone every person don't know means this uh, test book and there is a app like test book and which will give you a wonderful subject like this but uh, uh, i thought before that but when i come to my brother came to me and said that uh, okay go through the test book uh, it will give you the means 100% results it, it he said actually he also qualified for some other exams so i gone through this and i am really very very satisfied with test book and i am really very happy that i choose test book for my preparation so i am really happy i choose test book sir okay sir so it was nice meeting with you and again congratulations to your mom dad and you and your family and i wish sir. you luck in the future and god bless you sir sir i have to mention one thing uh, actually in this uh, thing I, i have to thank to my father sir actually he supported me so in this presence i have to i want to thankful i am very thankful to my father and i have to say this in last so i i told you sir that that's me okay so all the best for the future uh, satish may god bless you uh, to get your further dreams if you want to get a- anything else in your life so may god assist you in getting that your in getting your dreams okay so thank you for joining the session it was nice meeting you thank you sir thank you so much